Hi guys, Chef Mike Ward here. Today I want to share with you three simple homemade pizza recipes that are crazy easy, full of flavor, but most of all my kids go nuts over them and I'm pretty sure yours will too. First up, I'm doing a melt in your mouth veggie pizza. Second, a meat lover's pizza. And third, kind of a gourmet pizza that I know will satisfy the pickiest pie connoisseur. As a father and a chef, I don't believe that feeding our kids should be a daunting task. That's why I've teamed up with Walmart to create tips for parents on how to feed those hungry little impatient mouths. The goal is really simple, to help parents like you and I create fun, delicious, healthy meals for our kids. Now I love pizza because it gets the little guys involved in the cooking process and at my house, that at least guarantees that they'll try it. Plus, I get to control the ingredients, which means I can pack these pizzas with healthy produce. Best of all, the kids do most of the work, and what parent doesn't like that, right? So let's get started. Okay, vegetarian pizza. Now I'm using a pita bread base. Uh, on this one, I'm using a white bread, but I'm also gonna use whole wheat. Now, I've got a beautiful store-bought pesto here. You could use tomato sauce as a base. Then I've got some gorgeous mozzarella here. I've got some cherry tomatoes here that I've chopped in half. I've got some black olives. Imagine the fun the kids will have making this. And then I've got some fresh basil. And we're done. You've got to use really good ingredients. Everything I picked up here I got from Walmart. They carry Canada number one grade fruit, vegetables, and maple leaf grain fed chicken. Vegetarian pizza is done. Now I'm on to Mike's magical meat loving pizza. Now I am using a whole wheat pita for this one. And my base is going to be a gorgeous store bought barbecue sauce, smoky, sweet, and rich. I've got some chorizo sausage here. You could use pepperoni if you like. I've got some delicious smoky roasted red peppers here from the jar. You don't need to roast them yourself. Some finely chopped red onion, which is gonna bring me a little bit of spice as well. I've cut that really finely, so that will cook in the oven. And to finish the meat lover's pizza up, I'm gonna use feta cheese, which is gonna bring a little bit more saltiness. The goal here is to make your life easy and to get them fed. Okay, my veggie pizza and my meat pizza are done. Now I'm onto my precious gourmet, but do not be put off by this. This is something that the kids will also enjoy as well. I am back to a white pita bread here. For the base of this one, I'm using a gorgeous store-bought tomato sauce. I've got some gorgeous Parmesan cheese here that I've cut in a very thin little slices. I've got some delicious marinated artichokes. That's gonna give me a little hit of acidity. I've got my prosciutto ham here. Fat from that is gonna melt a little bit and that's gonna crisp up. Now I've got my arugula here, but I'm gonna put that on after I roast the pizzas because I want that fresh. Okay, three pizzas done in the oven, about 400, 15 to 20 minutes, just keep an eye on them. So there it is, three super simple pizza recipes that your kids can make with you. For more kid-friendly recipes from Walmart, check out one of the links right now on the screen and check out the Pinterest board link below in my video description. Be sure to like this video, share it, subscribe to my channel, and I post new videos all the time, so we'll see you really soon.